So, God, I ask, oh God, that you continue to uh, lend us your, your spirit, oh God, leading God us. We lift up our leaders, oh God, continue to give them the wisdom and knowledge on how to lead and guide your people in the right direction. And God, not only the leaders, but we ask your blessings upon their families. Oh God, just bring us together that one cannot call out the other. And most of all, God, the body of Christ will be edified, you will be glorified, and Satan himself will be horrified. We thank you and we love you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you, uh, John Pimpton, I'm going to lead the same way. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic on which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <laughs> The uh, minutes are, are in everyone's packet. Is there any deletions or additions to those from last month? If not, we'll have to have board approval on that and same with Charlie. Charlie Yes. Charlie Norris. Yes. Paul Simpson. Yeah. Edwards Smith. Yeah. Minutes approved. Oh, and I apologize. Uh, uh, Chris is, is going to be asked tonight. Um, he had a, something that he had to attend to. Couldn't, couldn't, wasn't able to make it. Thank you, Father God. Yes. Yeah. <coughs> uh, next is the financials, and those are in your packet. They too will need board approval. Is there any? Make a motion to approve. Motion by Paul Simpson, second by Edward Clinton. Any further discussion? John Pilson. Yes. Johnny Norris. Yes. Paul Simpson. Yes. Paul Simpson. Yes. Motion carried. Next up will be Chief Burks with the police department. Mr. Mayor, board, the month of July, we answered uh, 79 incident reports. We were 14 accidents with no major injuries. We issued 222 citations. And July was just a Thank you, Chief. Next is the fire department, but Chief Carr and some of the firemen are in Dallas uh, with some doing some training. So we're going to skip to Parks and Rec with Miss Susan Bank. Uh, 
we're just getting ready to start our fall programs. Uh, just doing registration for fall, working on uh, just getting ready to start the uh, environmental reviews for the Dixie Park since we got our phase two uh, grant last week uh, that we're real proud of and excited about and uh, hope to get that started real soon and our walking trail and uh, the creek lakes working on and we just got a lot working. Any questions? There's no problem building restaurants out there. Thing we no. Uh, that had already been cleared before uh, Bruce Falling, uh, before we applied for the grant. He went in and did a study and found where we were placing all the money and everything. And, and I think also came back from this hydrolysis uh, <coughs> study that they done that we could probably use more of the land than we thought we could to begin with. So uh, I think we're, we're sitting real good with that. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, Building inspector Jim Ripple will now seek today, so we're going to skip to city attorney, Mr. Terry Abernett. You guys just get mad here for civil life. Just don't get mad at Well, let me move. I'm not kidding. I just asked civil about, about those signs. We, we, yeah, we. I didn't think somebody ought to have that from uh, Well, to be civil next month is. Is it four years or three years? That's since that grant was on that. Three years? Three. Three. And then five for pain. <laughs> uh, I'll fly on my front. We've uh, got to go to Fort Friday on one of these uh, traffic field cases. That's not something I don't think you can tell. We'll spend a lot of time working about it. I'll just let you know how it comes out. We'll see how much you have got to do with it. Other than that, it's any word on the southwood? No, no. Uh, we got some, uh, I got someone to get me some information where this, uh, uh, where the lady had relocated. <coughs> as soon as I can figure out if that's accurate information, at least I'll let the judges follow her. So there's a method of doing that in another, in another state. So I've got an address. So as I confirm it's a good address, we'll see what happens. And uh, Paul, as uh, far as the, I've never heard, I've never even gotten a letter back from the Department of Safety. Uh, I'm not, again, asking about it, their suggestions or ideas that we could do something about it. But no, uh, no, 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 they're very busy, I'm sure. The last time I responded, but don't know how to answer that. Does it? I may hear from them someday. Thank you. Thank you, Terry. I could tell you, excuse me. I could have said that I, I don't like the judge will expect anybody to come over there with But I've got court that day, so I will be there if he does. You know, but I will be there. To represent the city if he does need it, but I don't think he will. But I clearly said I'll be there in court, so nobody else needs to go. Okay, it's all worth that. Richard Ash with Public Works. We have a pretty busy month this month. We build 2,100 customers. Uh, we lay off about 340 cars for non payment. We already cut off 102 for non payment. We already pumped 70 million gallon of water, treated 40 million gallon of sewer. We have been really busy with this ISO that everybody's already doing now. Uh, every fire department that's in our area, we have to get a lot of information for. Uh, we have the, the, the upgrades that we've already made. And with the extra effort that everybody's already putting in, uh, looks like we may be okay this year, but you never know until the COVID is. But we have, uh, have actually been able to raise our cost with the water supply. And uh, I just wanted to give you a little update on our GIS system. Uh, that is where we are 
digitally mapping our or the power system. You know, we'll be able to layer it with uh, the water system, the gas system, the sewer system, fire hydrants we can put. Just all <clears throat> a lot of information about uh, our hydrants, but the longitude, latitude, elevation, pressure, gallons per minute that we've already put out. And after we get all of this done, then we will layer it with what 911 is already doing. So that ought to help us hold it down, but the road will do more also. And other than that, we just been on hanging up. Anybody got anything they'd like to ask? Thank you much. <clears throat> Thanks, Rick. Moving on, uh, there is no old business to uh, address tonight, so we'll move right into new business, which is only two items. First is uh, we will need board approval to allow the Sandler Fire Department to apply for a PML driver safety grant. Second. Motion by Paul Simpson, second by Johnny Knowles. Any further discussion? Is that a 50 50? Yes, it is. Is this one he talked about that one? Yeah. Okay. Sam Tolo. John Kelson. Yes. Johnny Norris. Yes. Paul Simpson. Yes. Edward Smith. Yes. Motion carried. Last item on tonight's agenda is board approval to award the bid to Redmond Asphalt Incorporated for the resurfacing on Falcon Street in the amount of $85,000. And they were the, actually the only ones who uh, to bid on it. So, uh, uh, and if you would explain the distance from the actual look like stopping so that I know what we're talking about. Okay. Motion by Paul Simpson, second by John Pendleton. And it, what it is, it's uh, roughly 5,280 feet of, of resurfacing asphalt that will be uh, put on Falcon Street, this side of the bypass and the other side. If there is a there is a gap there is, there's actually a couple of gaps in between there that there's still some really good surface um, but the majority of it will be just about completely done from one end to the other but eighty five thousand dollars only will that's what it costs to do a, to do a mile um, I know they are back back talking today. Industrial yeah, industrial park has got meals yesterday. They, I think they started paving on it. That will go from the bypass all the way to the Hinko entrance. And then I've also been told that it's my understanding that Jones Street will get paid, also repaid, when when they get done working on that section of the solar farm. We have a motion in the second. Is there any further discussion? John Pemberton? Yes. John Norris? Yes. Paul Simpson? Yes. Richard Smith? Yes. Motion carries. And that's it on tonight's agenda. Any night you need to address the board? Motion to adjourn. Thank y'all. I'm <laughs> 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 <laughs>